welcome back to learning with GeoSnips. We are back with another video tutorial. Today our topic of discussion is reclassify. Reclassify is nothing but the classification of your data sets value into some specified number of classes. You can take an example as if you have uh, the values in your data from 0 to 200 and you want to divide it into 4 classes. So what will you say? You will say from 0 to 50 it will be first class, 50 to 100 it will be second class and so on. So that's how basically classifying our data on the basis of specified classes. Uh, we is do it in the form of reclassify in QGIS. So if you will just explore the image we have added. It is a raster data set as you can see. Now right click and go to properties. In properties we have re selected render type as unique value. Now if you will explore this you can see that we have 10 unique values in our data set other are defined as no data value so we want to classify these 10 values into four classes how we can do that just go to processing select toolbox and in toolbox search reclass and then there will be an option under grass raster and then reclass click this option a new window will appear it will ask you for the input layer just specify the input layer and in the second option it will ask you the file which contain the reclass rule means uh, how you want to reclassify 0 to 50 equals to 1 50 to 100 equals to 2 these rules should be defined in a text file so you can create a text file we have created here now you can see from 1 to 3 we are going to define it as class 1 from 3 to 6 we are defined it as class 2 6 to 9 3 and 9 to 15 we are defining it as class Four, and you can save this text file now in the second option where it wants the rule select that text file we are selecting it and then run the process once you will run the process it will take a while and then close the window now you can see our image has been added and once you will explore this go to properties and now you can see that only four classes have unique value other is defined as no data value so now my image has been reclassified into four classes from 11 classes so that's how basically we perform reclassification in qgis that's it for today thank you